Scunner was a Category 4 Kaiju featured in the movie Pacific Rim. It was around 440 feet tall and weighed around 3,230 tons. It has four arms that allow it to swim faster underwater. Now it was shown to work together with Raiju and Slattern during the fight against Gypsy Danger and Striker Eureka. Now it appears to have a thick skin and its head has two large curved horns that protrude outwards. It somewhat resembles a bull. Now Scunner was detected near the breach alongside Raiju. These two remained by the breach to protect it from the incoming Jaegers. They both swam around the two Jaegers, slowly stalking them in the darkness. The Jaegers had a lack of visibility, so this made it hard to see any incoming Kaiju. When Slattern arose from the breach, it attacked Striker Eureka. Meanwhile, Scunner tried a sneak attack on Gypsy Danger by trying to ram its horns into it, but it was held back as it took a few hits to the head. Then, Raiju came to its aid and bit off Gypsy's right arm. Scunner used this opportunity to bite into Gypsy's right knee and damaged it severely, but this attack left it open as Gypsy used its left sword and sliced through Scunner's head. It was dragged to a nearby thermal vent where part of its face was burnt up. Surprisingly, Scunner managed to survive a bladed attack through its head. It's at this point where Raiju comes to help it, but it gets sliced in half by Gypsy's sword. Scunner then hears the call of Slattern and swims back to aid it. Now these two kaiju plan to attack Striker Eureka at the same time. But as they do, Striker's bomb is detonated. This massive explosion kills off Scunner. But Slattern was quickly injured and still alive. It goes on to fight Gypsy Danger in the final scene. So that covers Scunner in Pacific Rim. I kind of liked its design and it turned out to be one of my favorites. Now it was also featured in the video game and it was given an energy based super move which looked like a big blue plasma ball. It was also listed as being the largest category 4 kaiju to ever appear from the breach. Now I like how each kaiju is different from the rest, so with the new movie in production, I'm curious to see what kaiju designs they'll have and what category they'll be. So what did you think about Scunner? Did you like its design in the movie? Put your thoughts in the comment section. If you want to see more videos around Pacific Rim, then subscribe to the channel. And enable notifications so you know when I upload a video. Thanks for watching, my name is Asaglow, and I'll see you in the next video.